Um, but yeah, do you think uh, Connor McGregor was waiting to see if they could get a crowd back before he agreed to fight? That's what I think happened. You think he wanted the crowd? No, no, no. I think it was negotiations for Habib. You think so? All this, like, yeah, yeah, it has nothing to do with the crowd, man. If the guy wanted to fight, he would fight. He's not get. Uh, he he was negotiating for Habib, and then just, and then just, uh, no, no, it was hundred percent. Everything was about Habib. Oh, I know he was then. negotiating. Uh, I know he was negotiating through through different people. I know he was negotiating for that fight. He was asking, whatever, whichever way possible, he was asking for that fight, and so he was hoping that he'll get it. And then Habib is just man of his word, just keeps his word. Like, and it's not about the money; it's about whatever. So there's just then, so many people in that lightweight, so many matchups in the lightweight division that I want to see. And even <clears> if they went up to 172, uh, it, it's just insane. So there's that, those three cards coming up uh, in January, which is going to be crazy. Um, do you care about, I was talking to TJ Laramie. He wants the crowds back. Do you want them back? Like, is it really important to you or do you just want to fight at this point? Uh, you know, <clears throat> at this point, I just want to fight, but I've been always, cause my number one problem, I have losses in my career, which up until I lost, I was winning. So it was, it was mainly, it's not an excuse. It's, it's the fact, it's the reality that, uh, main reason that I don't perform even at 20% of what I what I can do, and people know, everybody that inspires me, they know what I can do. It's it's, it's because of the pressure, the, the bright lights, people, the fans, because for BTC, I sell out the arenas all the time, and, and I have so much support. It puts so much pressure into me that I, I really don't even feel my legs. I, 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 I throw the kick and I sleep on, in a cage. You know what I mean? I don't feel the distance and everything. And, and I've been always... I've been always, even before Corona, I've been thinking, what if there will be no crowd or no cameras? I'm, I was, I was always confident that I will perform much, much better, because I believe that everything is psychological and it's all my number one problem for me. Not technique, not none of that. Well, technique is you always have to progress and everything, but right now, it's all my loss is number one problem was psychological part, and then right now. I see I haven't fought without people yet. I fought when arenas were full. February 29th was my last one. So I haven't fought in this empty arenas. I will be able to tell this after my next fight. But so far, I I, I just want to get a fight in. And I'm actually happy that there's not going to be any people. So I can have this theory in my head. Either it's going to be a reality or whatever. It was just a theory. So I can actually put it into into test 